We are at the Western Wall in the day in the Tish Aba, which is a very important morning day. The Jews are um, sad and fasting because of so many things, but two of them is the destruction of the Jewish temple uh, by the Babylonians, and the other one is by King Herod. And you can see that the Jews are mourning, sitting on the floor, reading uh, mostly. Uh, the necessary thing uh, like lamentation, book of lamentation. They are not sitting, uh, they are not wearing shoes, uh, leather shoes because it's not allowed. They are not here drinking and not eating, not using creams and any, any other uh, perfume. And um, um, I just finished taking a very beautiful, I believe very important, no, what important is, is more, uh, you know, more appropriate to say. A video of the nine of month of Av uh, that started from Damascus Gate uh, till here. I think it's worth uh, um, watching, and uh, uh, please watch it on my YouTube. And uh, if you are not yet my uh, uh, my subscriber, please sus subscribe. Now I'm climbing up to the Jewish quarter to show you how the Jewish quarter looks like at that day. Because it's not a regular day. Uh, but look at the Muslim quarter. You can see the Muslim, it's old. And look at the Jewish quarter. And you can see that the Jewish quarter is mostly fresh, um, new. In 1948, the United Nations declared two countries. Palestine for the first time in their life, and Israel, uh, you know, we've been, I mean, the, the Jews been here for 3,000 years, waiting to get their freedom again. Then for them it wasn't me. At the same day, um, the Jordanians here occupied future Palestine, that never been exist as a country even for one day, and they changed the name of it to the West Bank. And from that time, it's an occupied land, but by the Jordanians, and they reached the old city of Jerusalem. Now, the old city of Jerusalem is not supposed to be um, in the hands of the Palestinians, and wasn't was it supposed to be in the hands of the Jews? But let me see if I can go out. I'm not through the toilet. <laughs> let me see. I can. It looks like I can. And I'm going out. Then the old city of Jerusalem was supposed to be owned by United Nation. Da -da -dum. But it's been occupied by the Jordanians. And uh, the Jordanians did another thing. They destroyed the Jewish quarter. Then the Jewish quarter, as you can see, it's mostly new. So nice that you can hear even the Mazin. But look how beautiful is the view. Kasel Aksamas and the Dome of the Rock. The Dome of the Rock is the site of the Jewish temple. The Jews are not praying through the wall. They are praying through the temple. Where are we in that beautiful map? Then you can see that there are four different neighborhoods. Let's start with the Muslim one. Let's continue with the Christian one around the Church of the Holy Sepulchre and the Armenian one and the Jewish one. We just came from the Western Mall and we are climbing all the way up to travel around that. Gosh, it's hot and humid. Beautiful view of the temple that King Herod built. Now it's a fasting day, morning day, uh, but it's a very important. Uh, it's not like Shabbat. You can use electricity, you can smoke cigarette, um, but you cannot eat and drink. And I forgot to drink before I enter to the 
were small and the Jewish temple that let me suffer a little bit as well. As well. Then we are climbing up to the upper city. The upper city used to be the city of uh, the priest of uh, Jerusalem. And the story of Jerusalem is building, destroying, building, destroying, building, destroying. How different it's going to be from a regular day. First of all, it's wartime. And every moment we are waiting for Iran and the other terrorist organizations that she keeps to attack Israel. Why we are not attacking them, although we know that they're going to do that, I don't have the answer for that. But let us see. What about the shops? Here? Can you buy things? Can you buy food for later on? If the supermarket will be open soon, they will open an amazing uh, museum. It's called the Rodion Quarter. It's a city of priests from 2000 years ago. They are renovating it for more than a few years. I heard that it's going to be something special. Let's cross some fingers. A beautiful German crusader church. You can see now Mount of Olives. And the tower on top of it is the Ascension Church. To the right is the Jewish cemetery. From the time of King David until now. That the Western Wall is empty. Ah, you can see those two people. I'm so happy that I found them. That's why you can hear me breathing. Because I wanted to take a picture of them. And what he actually said that life is happy only without internet and movies. It's not, look at that. It's not a white Jew. Every Jew is not a red smartphone. Every Jew is not a red smartphone. And this is the supermarket. Even the supermarket. It's closed, although, although uh, you can, can buy food. Oh, um, when I'm taking a video, that video, I consider it to be as uh, 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 pagan. No one, no Jewish, but I actually say that even um, there's a kosher telephone, uh, and even that one is not allowed according to them. Life is happy only without internet and movies. That's in my videos as well. And not even internet, even kosher internet or kosher telephone. Um, is it allowed to, for them to say, of course it's allowed. Uh, are they considered to be crazy? Not so. There are so many people who are actually following them. Then, uh, it's, it's, it's nice to see it, it's nice to see that people are accepting it. Um, uh, yeah, there are so many different people in the, in the world. Um, two or three more won't uh, change a lot. Uh, yes, the museum will be open today. It is. The museum is actually open. Uh, in that museum, you can enter to one of the uh, of the 
priest houses, we know the name of it, Kachuros, one of the 24 families of priests. Now, this is Tiferet Israel, Israel, Tiferet Israel, the glory of Israel synagogue, that now they are rebuilding it. It's been destroyed in 1948 by the Jordanians when they destroyed the Jewish model. Restaurants are closed. Let's see if the orange juice uh, or ice cream will be open or not. It's closed. In every uh, place here, every kosher place, you must find the certificate that actually say that it's kosher. The few layers, uh, labels of kosher, and this is the highest one, mehadrin. Oh, it's beautiful to see. There's a wonderful mu a museum that I will ask you to visit. And this is the David Tower Museum. And they actually say here, beware of that museum, Migdal David, because there are some uh, rooms that are for different religions. Um, and in the Christian room, there are pictures of um, pagan things. And it's actually functioning on uh, Shabbat and, uh, uh, and uh, holidays. Then in that case, avoid that. Now, buying a gift is not a show. Is, not, is, is, is it allowed or not? It's not. Because to buy a gift is to do something very happy. Then uh, in that case, it's closed. Let me see if the ATM is open or not. Can you withdraw money on uh, nine of month of Av? You see, the bank itself is closed. And the ATM, which is a kosher ATM, then I know the answer. Yes, you can. Yes, you can, because it's no Shabbat. You can withdraw money. I was sure that you won't be able to do that. But this is the difference between Shabbat and regular day. Another synagogue, and you can say that it's new, they rebuilt it again in 2010, and that one been destroyed by the Jordanians as well at 1948. But you can see that the shops are closed. It's a memorial day, it's a fasting day. And not a lot of people are here, because I am not fasting, of course. Um, then, then, because it's so difficult to be here uh, and to fast, because it's so hot. Uh, I'm thirsty as hell, but I won't drink water in the Jewish quarter. It's like I won't drink water or eat at Ramadan time at uh, the Muslim quarter. Uh, Lent, I try not to eat as well, next to religious people. Oh, he is, he is, he's playing. I don't know if he will play uh, near us, but he is playing. See, guy, yeah, you will see that he's sitting without shoes. He's fasting for sure. So strange to see the quarter so empty. Again, on Shabbat, it will be difficult for me to take a picture uh, of it because I'm, I need to respect the Jews. But uh, and, uh, so that shop was open because it basically, basically for tourists that we don't have. Uh, I want you to see a very ancient street, 6th century, it's called the ancient corridor. Wow, wow, that is so strong. We have another 115 people 
who are held as prisoners. They've been kidnapped. They've been kidnapped. Some of them were soldiers. Ah, it's not it's not the 115. I don't know every picture. Yeah, yeah, I can see that there are mostly soldiers. One of them I knew him, so I can tell you All right, and who actually you actually knew? Can you tell me about him? I don't know if you can see it from here. This this column is the second one after. I'm not sure if you can see it from here. Um, but his name was Zachary Haber. Um, um, what's happened to you? He, he was called up for a jerk duty, served for a few few months. He was in and out and out, um, and was killed there. Was oh, killed wow. in Aza, uh, left behind his wife and three young children. Wow. He was having a baby, really, and two children. So sad. Um, so that's why I know that I think most of the rest of them are also soldiers. You can see a lot of the pictures. Is it especially for nine a month of Aza, or uh, it was before that? That verse there for those things do I leap is from it's from Eicha. It's from Eicha. Right? Yeah, done. So then. I, I, it wasn't here last time I was here, which was a few weeks ago. So I'm assuming. No, a few it was weeks ago, I'm sure. Then maybe it is. It's such an amazing uh, thing. Thank you very much. I, I think it was. I'm assuming it was longer today. I think it's. It's yes. It also, yes, honestly, yeah. it looks like it hasn't been disturbed. And yeah, it's then it's new. It's you know. Yeah. It's all made of paper. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. yeah. True. Well, thank you very much. You yes. like my idea? my day now. Sure. Thank you. Then the study is something new, and this is beautiful. But the street itself is six. Uh, sixth, uh, station, uh, sixth century. Remember, I don't know if you watched my previous video that start from Damascus Gate, and um, and uh, and I told and I show you, I show you uh, kind of two main streets. One I call it the corridor that reached the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. The other one we used to reach the Western Wall, and this is the other one. This is the other one. This is a totally Jewish group, but not from Israel. But they are, I'm not sure they are fasting. They are happy. Yeah, it's like a birth rights. And this is another important thing that I wanted to know. Uh, Israel is bringing for free uh, Jews, mostly youth. They've never been in Israel. Can you imagine that a Jew? never been in Israel. For me, it's, it's hard to believe, hard to accept that this is that Jewish uh, group, or one of them. Right. You can see here bread. And just this is two non-Jewish uh, places here. Uh, speaking French. And now I know for sure that they're not fasting because it actually talks about the food that they can buy here if you are, they are hungry. But that supermarket, remember the, uh, the first supermarket was closed. That one is open and it's okay to work. If you can fast and work, it's okay. Because people can buy food for the children uh, that not fasting. Uh, people can buy uh, food and uh, for later on, prepare the meal after the fasting day, which will be around 1900 uh, or 20, between 19 to 20 hundred hours, um, between seven, it's close to seven. Point four, three, uh, I, I don't know, 7, 7 30 p.m. And we are leaving now the Jewish quarter and entering to the um, to the uh, Armenian quarter. I wanted to see one more thing before we are saying goodbye and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you can support it the few options at the description, at the text. I'm not working for more than 10 months because of the war. I would be happy if you will support that channel. Then, women's Eicha, reading Eicha, it's the book of lamentation. Turn right here and continue until you first left. That was for yesterday.
Dan, thank you very much for being with me and see you, see you in my next video. Bye-bye.